we might have a solution to our expensive carburetor problem. Carburetor problem. Welcome back to Johnny's XJ. Yep, those of you who watched my last video will remember my carburetors separated, but not how I wanted them to separate. They, they should be, basically they should be bonded onto there. But they're not. So, checked out online to see how much these are. Uh, and you have two sides, two for each side. £89 something each side. So you get two of these for 89 quid. Yeah, okay. So I've actually been looking for tubing and I've found this silicon radiator tube, same diameter. And I'm hoping to fix that onto there. But obviously, they've got to machine all that away. So I want to file all that off. And I can slide that onto there. And I can cut it to size. And then hopefully I can stick them back onto there. I've managed to free the coal rutters. They were jam solid. And now they're nice and free. The choke was jam solid. Where did that go? But now it's nice and free. So that's all the chokes and the uh, throttle butterflies sorted out. So now I've got to uh, take all the float bowls off and clean everything up inside. So I will save you the uh, boring cleaning bits and I'll see you in a bit. Yes, we're inside today because it's too bloody cold out there. It's frosty, man. Oh, it went, it went, it's gone. Can you see any daylight through there? Yeah, so can I. We've got the wrong spanner. I wonder what that one is. I've never seen that one before. It's another jet sort of thing. Sort of kind of thing. It's a sort of jet. I don't know. There's no holes in it. Ah, it's for the needle valve, isn't it? The needle valve, it's for the... You know, the, 
the long needle that goes straight through. What's it called? I don't know. That's what that's for. Just see the little needle there. Boys and girls. I'll leave that one in for now. Don't think we need to take that one out. When working on carburetors, you often get these screws, what won't budge. So you can either make a little groove and try and tap them out with a small chisel. But first I like to try with mole grips. If you can get on them with mole grips and turn them, that's great. But if not, then you probably want the chisel. Chisel, Mr. Whizzle. And hopefully it'll snap. Not snap, you know. It'll crack. It won't snap, it'll crack. Don't want it to snap, do we? Come on, turn, 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 turn. Nothing's happening. No, I'm on two four. I'm just pressing against that. Just pressing against the body. Oh yes. Come on, come on, done. You know you want to. No, we just turn it. We're just turning on the screw a little bit tighter. A little bit tighter and try again. Oh, that was tight. Come on, baby. You know you want to come on down. Yes, we've got it, we've got it, I'm sure we've got it. Oh. By Joe, I think we've done it. But what I've actually done is squashed it together. So now you can't get the screwdriver in it. Still not going. It did turn though, I seen it turn. I seen it, I seen it turn. Yes, yeah, definitely turning. Come on, you goddamn son, Twitch. And there you have it. One way of undoing nasty screws. Yeah. as if you didn't already know. And if you can't get your mold whips on like that one, another way is brute force and ignorance. Brute force and ignorance. See if I can whack this without whacking the camera. Be very careful. 
things are very easy to break. See that? Can you see that very well? It's very light taps. Ouch. Can't see sod all, can you? We try and get a better wrangle. Getting a bit violent now. Calm down, boy. Don't think anything's happening. Nothing's happening. I'm getting in deep shit. If I can get a nut on the other side, if I drill it out, go get a nut under there. Yeah, nor do I. Come on, help me! Help me to help you! <laughs> what your screw looks like. Cool, my experience eludes me. <laughs> cool, that one looks a bit rough, doesn't it? Especially around there.
That look nice. Smells nice. Okay then, that's all the carburetor is cleaned out inside. So let's do the bench test. See if we've got any leaks. So now I'm going to fill it up with fairy liquid petrol. Wish me luck. Well, it's going in. Is it coming out anyway? Oh, looking good so far. Looking good, Master. Yep, still going in. I think it's going in. Lift it higher. Go higher, go higher. Can't go any higher than that, can I? I think it's stopped. leaks. We have carburetors with no leaks. Wicked. Yeah I'm chuffed about that. Didn't want to have to separate them. Oh yeah that took the tops off because I can't get the bloody things off. So hopefully they're going to be moving free. So, there we are. All I've got to do now is uh, sort my flanges out. God. Come on, you be good girl, be good girl. See you again soon.